Agents, this is headquarters. There's been a report of elephants trumpeting in a neighborhood in Ohio. Ohio? That's in the United States. There aren't wild elephants in the United States. <gasps> the the snuggler. snuggler! She must have taken the elephants to Ohio. Let's go. Elephants. Elephants, elephants, elephants. <laughs> Who wants to snuggle? Ah! It's coming from the backyard. Ah! Help! Help! Ah! Help! 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 Snuggler, you're under arrest for taking and trying to snuggle wild elephants. <laughs> but I only wanted to snuggle them. They're so cute. They are really cute. But you can't snuggle wild animals. And they don't belong here. You have to help us return these elephants back to the wild before someone gets hurt. Okay. Wait a minute. These aren't all Asian elephants. These elephants come from different places. I might have taken a few from Africa, too. Some of these elephants belong in Asia, and some belong in Africa. And so, the LFBI returned the Asian elephants to India and the African elephants back to Africa. The elephants are all back where they belong. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? I, I just wish I had something I could snuggle with. What about this? Oh! <laughs> Good job, Agent. Ella, fantastic work. And they all lived happily ever after. If you think superheroes are awesome, come with me. Howdy, mister. What can I do for you today? I want to be a superhero. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. Welcome to Dima's Superhero Superstore. We've got everything a superhero needs. Okay, hero, what kind of superpower would you like? I want to be super strong. Ooh, strong. That's a great superpower. Follow me. Whoa, cool machine. That's the Super Shower of Power! Just step right in and we'll power it up. I just need to set the dial to the right superpower. Super strong, super strong. Huh, I need your help. These pictures show the superpowers we can choose from. In order to be super strong, Gobi will need really big muscles. Which one should I use to make Gobi super strong? This one, this one, or this one? That one! Yeah, this one! With super strength, you can lift just about anything. Ready? Ready. Well, how do you feel? I feel super. <laughs> da, 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 da. Strong. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the superpower. You're welcome, hero. What time is it? It's time to lunch. What time is it? It's time to lunch. What time is it? It's time to lunch. It's lunch time. Hey, what's for lunch? Yum! I got a sandwich and chips for lunch. What did you get, Una? I got a sandwich and trail mix. What did you get, Nani? I got a sandwich and... tail mix? 
<laughs> I've got the paper from the paper shop. And I've got the... them... them... What's wrong? What should we do? Run! <laughs> to make a frame. Next, I'll use the paper as the part of the kite that catches the wind. Uh-oh, I have lots of paper, but I don't know which one I should use for our kite. I need your help. Which one of these pieces of paper matches the shape made by the bamboo frame? Should we use the circle, the rectangle, or the diamond? And the piece of red silk goes here for a tail. We've got our kite. Now we just need the string. I have it right here. <gasps> oh no, I must have dropped it. Now we can't fly our kite. We really need some string. Hey, look! String! I bet the rest is in... <laughs> Please don't run away again. I have your string. You dropped it back there and I picked it up. Thanks? Why were you peeking at us? Well, I'm just a little duck. A peeking duck. And I wanted to build a kite too. But I'm shy. Well, you know what, little duck? What? Everybody gets shy sometimes. Even you guys? Even us? Yeah, and we'll totally show you how to build a kite. <laughs> and so, the villagers showed the Peking duck how to build a kite. And they all lived happily, <laughs> I mean quackily, ever after. If you like fruits and vegetables, come with me. Hello. We'd like a smoothie, please. Well, you certainly come to the right place. Welcome to the fruit bowl, where we set them up and knock them down. Yay! Ah. <laughs> what would you like in your smoothie, ma'am? Well, Bun Bun loves carrots. So we'll make Bun Bun a carrot smoothie. Carrots are vegetables. We need your help. Where do carrots grow? On a tree, on a vine, or underground? Underground! That's right, carrots grow underground. Now we have carrots, a tasty vegetable. What about fruit for your smoothie? Bun Bun loves bananas. Okay, let's take a look. We need your help again. Where do bananas grow? Under the ground, on top of the ground, or on trees? On trees! That's right, bananas grow on trees. The bananas and carrots are all set up. And here's a cantaloupe. Bun Bun likes cantaloupe, too. Now it's time for you to knock them down. One carrot, banana, and cantaloupe smoothie coming right up. Look, Bun Bun. Somebody likes smoothies. <laughs> You. You're welcome. 
and thank you for your help. What do you have for lunch today, Gobi? I have pasta and cheese. What did you get, Molly? I have a ham and cheese sandwich. What did you get, Nani? I got macaroni and cheese. On your mark, get set, go! And there they go! The frogs and their runners are leaving the frog egg area. This way, Fernando! And they've made it to Tadpole Plaza! Like Fernando sees something he wants to eat. Uh oh! That's the wrong way! Fernando, wait! Oh no! It looks like Fernando and his runners are going the wrong way! Fernando, wait! Fernando, you're going the wrong way! Don't you want to finish the race? Okay, let's go! Oh, thank goodness they're back on track. But these streets can be very confusing. Uh-oh, I think we're lost. We need to get to the pond. We need your help. Which sign will show us the way to Fernando's home? That one, that one, or that one? That one, it goes to the pond. Right. Come on, Fernando. And it looks like all the frogs have made it back to their home in the pond. Except Fernando. Oh no! Fernando didn't make it! There they are! Ladies and gentlemen, here they come at last! Fernando and his runners! Bye, Fernando. We'll miss you. Uh. <laughs> Australia is really big. How are we going to find Joey? Hmm. It says here that we can find Joey. <laughs> What was that? <laughs> there it is again! Let's get out of here! <laughs> that was close! Now how do we find Joey? The slip says we're supposed to... Oh no! The slip's gone! How are we going to deliver the pizza? Hey! Maybe that's Joey. Pizza for Joey. Huh? No Joey here. I'm an emu. A bird. Try the billabong. It's that way. Thank you. It's that sound again. Let's go. So the pizza delivery guys hurry to the billabong. Hey, look. Pizza for Joey. Oh, pardon? Oh, no, I'm a platypus. The only Joey I know is a baby marsupial. A marsupial? That's an animal that carries its baby in its pouch. If you want to find Joey, you need to find a marsupial. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. But Joey's a baby marsupial. That means it lives in its mother's pouch. We need your help. Which one of these babies is a marsupial? This one! 
Ben. Right, the kangaroo. <laughs> oh no, it's that sound again. We better find Joey fast. <laughs> We got away. We need to find a kangaroo. Hey, there's a kangaroo. Pizza for Joey. Joey, did you order a pizza? <laughs> oh no! I can't look. What is it? It's a medium sized bird. G'day! I'm a kookaburra. A bird. You were the one making all that noise? That's right. <laughs> but why were you chasing us? You dropped your paper. Here. G'day, Sheila. Joey. G'day, Bruce. How you going? Not bad, I reckon. Hello. Are you the snow guppy? Yup. Thank you for calling the snow guppy line. Where everything's white and it snows all the time. Wait, he's the snow guppy? I guess so. If you come to my realm and you want to pass through, please wait for instructions after the woo. After the woo? What did you get for lunch today? I got a chicken sandwich and an apple. What did you get, Gummy? I got a turkey sandwich and a pear. What did you get, Nani? I got a cheese sandwich and a pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> Doggy doctors! I see. We'll be right there. The giant's great day needs our help. Let's go! Wow, that's a big house. Wow, that's a big dog. What's his name, Dr. Gobi? Hmm, Teeny. Well, that was unexpected. Oh boy, he doesn't look so good. I think he must be hurt. You'll be okay, boy. We'll take care of you. Dr. Dima, look, there's a splinter in his front paw. Ouch, that must hurt. I'll get the giant tweezers. And there you are. Good as new. <laughs> You're welcome, Teeny. Uh, Dr. Dima? It's the big bad wolf. Run for it! I think we got away again. That was a close one. Doggy doctors. H Hello? I, I can't quite hear you. You're breaking up. The deep dark woods? Hello? Who was that? I don't know, but they sounded upset. We better go to the deep dark woods and see if we can find them. The deep dark woods. These woods sure are deep and dark. Hello, doggy doctors! Are there any doggies who need our help? 
It's... It's... The Big Bad Wolf! Yeah, him! He's going to get us! Wait a minute. He's not trying to get us. I think he needs our help. Wow, he's really itchy. Don't worry, Wolf. We'll take care of you. We need your help. Take a look at this wolf's fur. What's making him feel so itchy? Fleas! Bugs! Right! Those bugs are fleas jumping around. We just need to wash away the fleas and you'll feel all better. Look! The fleas are going away. Do you feel better, sir? <laughs> Yay! Yay! Hey, Una, what did you get for lunch today? I got a cheese sandwich. What did you get, Goby? I got macaroni and cheese. What did you get, Nani? I got mac up. <laughs> mac up. Pony and cheese? <laughs> <laughs> but shots are important. They keep you from getting sick. Hey, everybody! Dr. Goby wants to dance! Do the checkup! Well, the doc says, I come on in. You look real good. How have you been? You got so big and look so strong. See if you can dance to my checkup song. Yeah, stick out your tongue, say ah! Ah! Stick out your tongue, say ah! Do the checkup. Well, you're looking good. Your throat looks fine. Your tongue stands on. Have a healthy shine. Come on, come on. Let's see what's next. We're going to check your leg for your knee. side of the moon any second now. Uh-oh. It's too dark. I can't see where I'm going. Let's turn on the headlights. The button is right here on the dashboard. Every car has a dashboard. It's where you turn on and off all the stuff in the car. Headlights on. That's better. Now we can see the road. Hey, do you hear something, astronaut Nani? Moon monkeys! <laughs> I think we lost them. We better get to the movie theater. So the astronauts went to look for the movie theater when suddenly... Uh-oh! I can hardly see anything. The windshield wipers. That's better. Moon monkeys! We definitely need to find that movie theater. There's the movie theater up ahead. What's wrong? Uh-oh. It looks like we're out of gas. Out of gas? <laughs> oh! Hey, Moon Monkeys! Up. What did he just say? I think he said, fill her up. Fill her up? <laughs> <laughs> Moon gas! All right! 
Thank you, moon monkeys. <laughs> and so, the moon monkeys gave the astronauts enough moon gas to drive to the movie theater. The movie started. Would anyone like some popcorn? Fill her up, fill her up, fill her up. <laughs> <laughs> and they all lived happily ever after. Good day, customer. How may I help you today? I need some magic supplies, please. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. The first thing you'll need is a top hat. Would you like it with or without a rabbit? With, please. Excellent choice. Abra Kadima. That's my magic word I made up. Hello, Bun Bun. Now, will that be cash or... Whoopsie! Oh my. There's only supposed to be one bunny in each hat. And this hat had one, two, three, four, five bunnies in it. We need to put these bunnies back where they belong. Abra Kadima! Oh no! Where'd all the bunnies go? They have to go back in their hats. Let's help Dima put one bunny in each hat. Look around the room. There's one. And there's another one. All right, bunnies. Into the hats. That's two bunnies. One in each hat. We need your help to find the last three bunnies in the store. Do you see another bunny? There's one. Right there. Right. We found three bunnies. But we need five. So how many bunnies are still hiding? Two! Two! Yeah! Where are the last two bunnies? There they are! Right there! That's right! One, two! Come on, bunnies! We found all five bunnies! Here you go, sir! One magic top hat with one bunny! Thank you! And thank you for your help! I've got the milk, made by the cows. Thanks, Mrs. Cow. That's the last ingredient. Now we can follow the recipe to make pancakes. Let's go back to the... Yummy! <laughs> Kitchen witch! <laughs> Let's get out of here! <laughs> Now we can finally make our pancakes. We need to add one cup of flour, one egg, and a half cup of milk. But how much is half a cup? We need your help. This is one cup. We need to fill half of it with milk. That means the milk goes up to here, right in the middle. Which one of these cups is half full? This one, this one, or this one? That one! That cup is half full! Right! The milk goes right to the middle. This cup is half full. You could also consider it half empty. We have the right amount of each of our ingredients. It's time to make some yummy pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> yummy! <laughs> the kitchen witch! Please don't eat us. <laughs> eat you? I don't want to eat you. I just want to help you make some yummy pancakes. <laughs> After all, it's important to have a grown-up in the kitchen. She's going to help us make the pancakes. You bet your sweet syrup I will. So the Vikings and the Kitchen Witch made pancakes together. Here come the pancakes. Catch them while they're hot. Flip it up. Flip it back. Flip it on the pancake stack. And they all lived happily ever after. Oops. Sorry about that nonny cakes. <laughs> 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 
You can ask your parents to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Bubble Guppies YouTube channel for new videos every week. And watch full episodes on the Nickelodeon and Nick Jr. channel.